The all-new Cinema Collection for Titler Pro is a broad collection of title templates from New Blue FX that will add beauty, ease, and versatility to your project's titles. Today, we'll be looking at a few of the titles offered in the Cinema Collection, as well as walking you through the process of adding and modifying one of these titles in Titler Pro. After downloading and installing the Cinema Collection, your new titles will be automatically added to your Titler Pro and Titler Live libraries. To access your new titles, create a new blue Titler Pro title, navigate to the library window, and open the Cinema Collection folder. Preview your new titles by hovering over their thumbnail in the library, and apply a template by double-clicking or dragging it into the workspace. Make quick changes to each title from within the Scene tab. From here, you can modify preset variables such as text fields and texture faces. Of course, you'll often want to make more elaborate changes. With Titler Pro, every aspect of your title is fully customizable. Let's demonstrate this by starting with a new template. Let's say we're making the intro to a thought-provoking thriller. We want our title card to be simple, yet elegant. The Walking Dread provides this, but of course, we're gonna need to make some changes to apply it to our own project. The background is almost what we need, but the floating particles make it look a little too grungy, so we're going to replace the particles texture with something a little flashier. To do this, click on the particles in the workspace, click the image slash video thumbnail to select a new file, and select a new video to take place of the particles. Once that's done, we want to click the eye icon beside the particles layer in the timeline to hide it because we're done working with it for now and we don't want to accidentally click on it. Next, we're going to change the text. Our new title is only one word, so we're going to delete the second word of the title, which has been separated for easier animation, and then double click the first word and change the text. We're also going to change the font using the text controls option in the styles tab and even though the current texture on the text still works well for us, the colors aren't exactly what we want, so we're going to leave the face texture how it is, but change the face color gradient to a more complementary color. Finally, let's move the whole text element down to the bottom left corner by dragging it by the handles in the workspace. Now we're going to repeat the same process for the subtitle. Change the text, change the font, change the color, and move it into position. One thing we're going to add to the subtitle, however, is a very subtle orange glow. In the style settings, click to add a 2D outline glow, select the appropriate color, and reduce the opacity so it looks like a faintly glowing neon light. The last step is to add animations. Luckily, our background and particle layers are videos, so they're already animated, but we want our text to have a little more character. Select the Transitions drop-down from the library, and open the Animations folder. We want to give the subtitle a typing effect, so we're going to open Type On, and apply Type Left to Right by double-clicking or dragging it onto the appropriate layer in the timeline. It seems to type a little slower than we need, so let's zoom out on the timeline, and drag the animation handle to make it a little tighter. We'll also take this opportunity to make the subtitle come in a little sooner, and the main title come in a little later. As far as an animation for the main title, we're going to repeat the same process. Navigate to the Animations folder, select the appropriate animation, in this case, Musical Chairs, and drag the handle to make it much shorter. Just by making a few small changes, we've reworked the Walking Dread template into something unique and original, and it took less than five minutes. With a wide range of templates and the unrivaled versatility of Titler Pro, the Cinema Collection gives you the tools you need to take your project to the next level. To learn more, visit newbluefx.com slash titling today.